Hello everyone, welcome back to another Postman tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll show you how you can uh, create a new workspace in your Postman account. Uh, to get started, just click on this button at the top here, the title workspaces. And then at the right here, you'll see this button, click on it, then you can create a new workspace by giving it a name. For instance, you can say then you can give a summary of this workspace and then at this third option you can choose whether this workspace is a team workspace which means it will be accessed by everyone who is in our team or you can choose if it's a personal workspace or also you can choose if it's a public workspace if you choose it as a personal workspace this means that this workspace will only be visible and accessible to your account then if you choose the team option it will enable the workspace to be accessed by all your team members if you select this workspace as a public workspace to be accessed by anyone on the postman network so for our case we'll go with that the team option so that anybody in our team can access this workspace then we'll just skip this option because for right now we don't want to invite any members to this team then we'll just click on create then once you create your workspace it will be automatically selected and then relaunched by your postman browser and then you can start using your workspace then how do you switch from one workspace to another you just click on this workspaces menu button then from here you click on the workspace that you want to use and then finally how do we delete a workspace just click on this workspace button and then select the workspace that you've created remember you cannot delete the default workspaces a default postman creates for you these two workspaces the my workspace one and then the team workspace so we'll select our api workspace like this so to delete this workspace as the creator of this workspace you can just select the workspace and then there are these three dots in the far right just click on them then click on delete workspace then to delete this workspace you just click on this button and then the workspace will be deleted completely from your account this man will reload and then it will take you to your home page then if you check the list of your workspaces the old workspace is removed then to rename your workspace just click on this drop down then select your workspace from here let's say you want to rename this workspace once you select the workspace it will open that particular workspace landing page on a new tab then from here you can click on these edit icons on the various sections to edit those sections like for the team workspace we can edit it and then we can name it bloom team workspace and then for the description or the brief summary we can edit it and give it a description of our own and then also you can uh, give a longer description of this workspace what happens here and what it's all about so that whenever anybody clicks on this workspace they can know exactly what this workspace is for we can give it uh, this description then once you do your editing you can just save the long description and then it will show here so that's how you manage a workspace on a postman remember to stay tuned on this postman series there is more coming see you soon in our next tutorial if you like this video click on the like button and also remember to subscribe see you soon